So men's doubles. Vessel and it was an awkward volley for him. Oh, straight. Missed. I hit them more with it. Put it away, actually. Great teamwork. What a start. Yeah. Confidence tends to run through the team, doesn't it, when you get off to a good start and everybody tends to play well. Not easy sitting on the bench and then coming out for the for the fifth set. This has been an excellent start. Fight there. What yes. A souvenir. Oh. Not clean, but sometimes dirty is nice. Sewn up so we can relax now and enjoy this, but it's not the case because the swing becomes big, doesn't it? In these last few games, change that winning percentage. Mm. 
what I like to call that double whammy effect. You're being pulled down by losing, but the other team is being elevated simultaneously. As their winning percentage increases. Yeah, and of course it's the Royals who were sitting at the top of the pile. Start of play today, and they look great in their two matches in Kobe, which they won pretty comfortably, but uh, all changed now. Third. Is wonderful. What a strike. This guy's such a versatile player. Yeah. Talking about the respective squads at the start of uh, the second IPTL season, we did say that Mavericks like, that, that were spoiled for, for choice as far as depth and strength was concerned. But I guess they will also be hoping that they can maintain a strong position because they've got the likes of Roger Federer to come as well. That guy's not bad. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Nice little dig there down to the feet of Gasquet. <laughs> to to shoelaces. 25-16 now. It's squeaky bum time for Brightside. And you're bearing down on the net. It's under a lot of pressure. Good dig. swing a little too readily at the high volleys. It's a mistake that a lot of players make at every level of the game. Understandable. Two all here. 25-17 now.
First volley. Nice strong wrist, firm grip on the racket, contact with the ball. No. Okay. Yeah. Serving there, just taking a bit of pace off the first, making sure that it finds its mark. Oh, yeah. Royals up, three two again. As you slowly start to freeze. Lost. It's a difficult volley, you've got no pace to feed off. You've got to still try and do something with the ball. Just come off the ball here a little bit after a very positive start. was doing his level best at the change events, trying to keep their spirits up, trying to keep them thinking positively. Yeah. It's more like it. Yeah. Comes a little pick up there from Nesta just to force them to hit a couple more shots. Very nice. Shaking his head. Come on, my bad. Chance to break here. A little bit of an opportunity. Make amends. Never misses that reserve. Ever. Exciting point. Burdick pushes him out of the way. games ahead rather than being on par as far as the score is concerned in this set. Oh, 
volley, that waiting for the ball to come to him rather than reaching out to meet oncoming return. take that ball while it was still above the height of the net. Big time tennis once again from the Frenchman. 27 18. That's just a start. The Royals were looking for to get back on serve. Good serving. Well to respond after serving the double initially. And this is a decent lead for the Mavericks. Could end up winning four of the five sets and uh, comfortably too. Lead 28 18. It's a ripper. That is so easy on the eye. It's provided us with a lot of eye candy as Ed Ward in the opening couple of days. Just getting a little frustrated now, Nesta. Over the handle. Of course, the shot making from the French pair. 
set point for the Mavericks. And didn't they enjoy themselves? Why not? Some fantastic tennis there. And uh, they get a comfortable win. Oh, what a night for the Philippine Mavericks. Comfortable winners, 29-18. Good technique on that first volley. Nice strong wrist grip on the racket, contact with the ball. Okay. Serving there, just taking a bit of pace off the first, making sure that it finds its mark. Royals up, 3-2. As you slowly start to freeze, it's a difficult volley, you've got no pace to feed off. You've got to still try and do something with the ball. Just come off the ball here a little bit after a very positive start. Love it. Mark Philippoussis was doing his level best at the change of ends, trying to keep their spirits up, trying to keep them thinking positively. That's more like it. Nice <laughs> little pick up there from Nesta just to force them to hit a couple more shots. Very nice. Shaking his head. Come on, my bad. Chance to break here. And he'd love an opportunity to make amends. Never misses that reserve. Ever. Exciting point. Burdick pushes him out of the way. Two games ahead, rather than being on the par as far as the score is concerned. So men's doubles.
Vessel and it was an awkward volley for him. Oh, straight. Nesta hit the more with it. Put it away actually. Not in trouble. Great teamwork. What a start. Yeah. Confidence tends to run through the team, doesn't it, when you get off to a good start and everybody tends to play well. Not easy sitting on the bench and then coming out for the for the fifth set. This has been an excellent start. Volley that waiting for ball to come to him rather than reaching out to meet oncoming return. Good urgency to take that ball while it was still above the heart of the net. Uh, 
Big time yeah. tennis once again from the Frenchman. Yeah. 27. Yeah. High fives are Follow the ball, and you're bearing down on the net. It's under a lot of pressure. Good dig. Swing a little too readily at the high volleys. It's a mistake that a lot of players make at every level of the game. Understandable. Two all here. 25 17 now. Fight there, what yes. A souvenir. Oh. 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 
Not clean, but sometimes dirty is nice. Sewn up so we can relax now and enjoy this, but it's not the case because the swing becomes big, doesn't it? In these last few games, change that winning percentage. Mm. That's what I like to call a double whammy effect. You're being pulled down by losing, but the other team is being elevated simultaneously. As their winning percentage increases, yeah, and of course, it's the Royals who were sitting at the top of the pile start of play today and they look great in their two matches in Kobe which they won pretty comfortably but uh, all change now Good. Is wonderful. What a strike. This guy's such a versatile player. Yeah. Talking about the respective squads at the start of uh, the second IPTL season, we did say that Mavericks like, that, that were spoiled for, for choice as far as depth and strength was concerned. But I guess they will also be hoping that they can maintain a strong position because they've got the likes of Roger Federer to come as well. That guy's not bad. <laughs> Nice. Okay. Nice little dig there down to the feet of Gasquet. It's time to bowl it out to my shoelaces. 25 16 now. It's squeaky bum time for Brightside. 